Hello everybody, my name is Walter, and this is a quick addendum to the tutorial of my 13x13 double door I released quite a few years ago. I was made recently aware of that this design apparently has a little bug that makes it directional and it doesn't work properly as shown in the tutorial when built in the north-south orientation. After a bit of research, I figured out this is a bug that was introduced with the 1.16 changes to the way Redstone behaves or Redstone wire behaves. And uh, there is a fix. Unfortunately, it would increase the size or the width by two, one on each end. And but before I get to the fix, let me quickly explain why and where this bug is happening. So currently the time is frozen, the door is about to open, and I'm just going to tick forward 70, what, 70 ticks. And what you will see is this multipiston extender here starting to extend. And what you can also see is we have a block here and we have a block here. And before 1.16, this block here was powered before this block here. Since 1.16, they are powered at the same time. And that causes under certain orientations and positions some issues with this piston here extending before this piston here. And that breaks simply the setup. The main issue here is that before 1.16, when this here was powered with a second strength of 1, it would not power the block. Since 1.16, it does power the block, which causes the timings changes and uh, yeah, causes it to break in north-south orientation, as already said. Now let me quickly unfreeze at the time. So we can have a look how to fix and that a little issue here. And uh, the easiest way to fix it is when it's actually in the open situation, because then we don't have any issues with disconnecting the parts here from the power. But as you can see, this is what we want. It should retract properly. Unfortunately, with the broken parts, it would not retract entirely and leave part of the sides open. Anyway, the fix is somewhat simple. We need to make sure that this wire here doesn't power the block. For that, we need to move it up by one. The same is also hidden behind here. Now, unfortunately, this setup here doesn't work anymore properly, so I have to remove these parts too. And now I need to make a bit of a loop to the outside, which is where the increased size comes from. So the two comparators now go there, we need some wire there, and we need a block here. And now we just need to mirror this towards the front, so we have the word block, the raised blocks, and then the raised block at the back there. And with that, the timing is the same again as it was before 1.16. And you should see the difference quite clearly if you look in this area where it will remain a staircase structure here. And on this side, it flattens out partially during the opening and the closing both. As you can see, now it flattens out. On the other side, it remains a pyramidal st structure. So... Um, I would actually recommend making this change to both sides. I'll leave it just here on one side so you can see the difference. But um, if you're building this in the north-south orientation, I would recommend doing this change. And also uh, the change to the top, uh, I showed you in another addendum, which is essentially just replacing those 10 uh, slime blocks with honey blocks. Likely a change also introduced with 1.16. Uh, or it might just be one of the normal random uh, piston bugs. But anyway, this is the end of this little end tutorial here. I hope you enjoyed it, and well, see you.